All right. This is a video about being aggressive to everybody, to everybody in the black community. And I'm going to mainly focus on us because a lot of us seen this in our households or around this or do it now. And the thing is, mainly I would say mainly uh, in the black household because a lot of us ain't got male figures around, our father figures. We grew up in the hood. So it's nothing but destruction, negativity, pumped on the TV when it's showing our people, all that type stuff. Nothing but drama, negativity. So a lot of us end up aggressive. We ain't got the father figure. She's trying to, you know, provide her early age for our moms and all this other stuff. Now, I used to think, hmm, since I grew up in a household seeing this, that, you know, yelling and yelling getting in people's face all this stuff being aggressive was like oh that must be something masculine i've seen men do it so i figured being aggressive is masculine that's what you're supposed to do as a man to put your girl in check not at all didn't know that actually that's actually weak like i didn't know none of that stuff at all back when i was doing it you don't get no respect no results nothing only time you should be aggressive is this view in a bedroom with your female of course and um if you're in a fight, you still want to strategize and you be aggressive. Pretty much only two places. There's nothing masculine about being aggressive to your female as far as, you know, she said something that got you mad and now you want to get in her face or now you want to hit on her or do something crazy like that. All it's showing is really weakness. Like, I thought that was strong not to hit a female. I never did that. But I thought it was, you know, I was like, oh, man, I put my girl in check because I yelled at her because I. You know, I did this, and I was super aggressive, got in their face. Like, no, nah, I thought I thought that was considered masculine. Not masculine at all, man. That's, that's really just, it's really weak as hell. Just showing you can't control it, your emotion. She pushing your buttons, and she's doing it on purpose. Like, how could you be respected when she control you? You can't even control yourself. She know if she say this one thing about you, you just going to snap and, you know, go off and go all crazy. And she over there laughing. She probably... Telling her homegirl, like, look, well, look, I'm about to get him mad. Watch this. Like, stupid. Nothing masking about being aggressive at all. The only thing you got to do is be assertive. You can get the same results from yelling just from talking to somebody. You ain't got to be a punk about it. You could just be in the middle. Like, you could be stern and just be like, hey, this ain't cool. This, this, and that. Get the same results that you would if you're yelling. Cause, well, actually, better results. Because you yelling, she going to yell, and then you yelling. Now you got a yelling match. You ain't going to win. You a, you a male. When it comes to yelling, it's just not going to happen. They going to out-petty you every time. Females is petty out here. Nobody got time for that. I'm a grown-ass man. I ain't got time for that. So, I realized. I said, oh, damn. Like, bro, I had no idea. I seen this on TV so much. I seen this in my community so much that I thought that's you supposed to just be aggressive with your female. No, you ain't supposed to be aggressive with your female for a regular-ass conversation. You supposed to just be at a, all right, cool, relaxed type cool calm collective type nigga like that's how you're supposed to be and it's crazy but learned a lot in the last few years now it's definitely one of the things i'm like wow okay so you don't have to be aggressive to get your point across you could just talk to somebody you could be cool calm and collected get better results everybody's cool now whether they listen or not they know they can't control your emotions, so they can't make you do what, you, what they want you to do. And at the end of the day, whether they listen to you or not, you still got your respect because you know how to hold your composure. You know how to stay chill. So just a um, video to anybody having a problem being aggressive, a couple of things you could do is anytime you feel like you're about to snap, I'll say do like, try to do like 50 push-ups or something. Do 50 push-ups. You feel like you're about to snap, take that anger out on the push-ups. And if you feel like you need to hit a female... Or you want to hit her upside her head or she want to hit her nigga upside the head. Like, you might want to start thinking about exiting the relationship. You should, if you feel like you need to hit your female physically, she probably ain't the one for you. Like, you need to just walk away, get out that relationship for real. But anyway, that's just something you can do if you feeling, um, feeling like real angry about a certain situations. Don't say nothing else. Hit the 50 push-ups and I guarantee you, you'll, you'll feel better and if you still want to kill a person you need to be in that relationship but peace